Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Amethyst Peyton Watson, aka the best budget shooting guard in the game. And I literally don't even have to try the card to already know that that is true. Well, spoiler alert, I've already tried his release in freestyle earlier. And because I know his release is great, I can look at the card on 2KDB and just see that he is phenomenal. He is an incredibly versatile, really well-rounded shooting guard option, easily the best budget shooting guard in the game, and a card that you are likely going to see on a lot of people's teams because because if you cannot afford the top five shooting guards in the game, there's just nobody better value for you to buy than Peyton Watson. If you don't have two of Kobe, Pippen, Dr. J, Paul George, and Vince Carter as your shooting guards, there is no reason to buy anybody else other than this Peyton Watson card at the shooting guard position. He is absolutely elite, even as a base 21,000 MT Amethyst. Before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 20,000 subscriber mark on the channel I upload every single day. Trying to hit that by the end of the month of February, which is going to be a big time grind, but I do believe it's possible. Would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe. Without further ado, let's hop right into it. Let's try out this Peyton Watson card. So he's six foot seven at shooting guard, 94 offense, 95 defense, great size at the two, 90 driving layup, 90 mid range, 93 ball, 90 close shot, 85 driving dunk, 80 standing duck, 88 free throw, 86 ball handle, 80 pass accuracy, 90 block, 90 perimeter, 88 interior and steel. Um, speed wise, 90 speed to a ball, 86 excel with a 92 vert, 85 strength, 95 stamina. 90 lateral quickness. Very well-rounded and elite statistics all the way around. Badge-wise, three hops are fearless finisher, off-ball pest, and blow-by. I mean, not the greatest hops. I like blow-by a lot, and off-ball pest is a good one as well, but 42 golds. Fast twitch, posterizer, blinders, catch and shoot, claymore, corner specialist, dead eye, green machine, guard up, even limitless range, slippery off-ball handles for days, unpluckable anchor, chase down ice, clamps, glove, interceptor, pick dodger, post lockdown, pogo stick, um, speed booster, fast feet, right stick, gripper, bulldozer, and 94 feet. Basically, the only badges that he is really missing, I would add rebound chaser to him i mean badging um amethyst is questionable but rebound chaser bailout and break starter would be big badge additions to him if you do want to badge him out i do think in general badging amethyst isn't the great idea but this is one of those cards that might be the rare exception if you really like him and want to use him um because bailout and break starter especially are pretty important badges with that being said his drag back is awesome yes his escape is hideous so his escape stinks this escape animation right there is the worst like that, that's one of the worst ones in the game so definitely going to be better off using your between the legs burst and same side burst as your main bursts with him but his release is so smooth quick easy to green just such a smooth fast release combine that with great athletic ability really complete stats and badges and um elite size at the two as well you're looking at one of the most versatile well-rounded and just elite budget cards in the entire game maybe the best new the new like best budget card in the game at least for this type of price point Twenty one thousand mt for a card that has this quick and this good of a release this complete stats and badges and this type of size at the two is just something that is very very rare um and i think this type of card come out with a couple other cards we've gotten today that mo bamba a couple other budget cards we're at the point where we're getting some really great budget cards on a weekly basis i love what i am seeing out of my team they're doing an awesome job really in every facet of content for the most part so with that being said that is going to do it for freestyle let's hop into a game let's see what peyton watson can do all right, our opponent is White Mamba. Got Oscar Robertson, D-Book, Carmelo, Paulo, and Embiid. Good squad. A little bit of an interesting backcourt between D-Book and uh, Oscar. Just a little bit small, um, but I don't hate the fact that D-Book is guarding Peyton Watson. It's probably the worst defender on the court. It's a positive matchup for us, and with Hoff Blowby able to get a good position and get the downhill drive first possession to get us a bucket on Devin Booker. Look at the player build, man. He is all of 6'7", uh, and you can tell he's got that size. I just hate that defense literally didn't move his feet at all i don't know what happened there to be honest just kind of got stuck in mud got stunned somehow off of that i'm not even really sure that's his fault i think that's just kind of the game sucking mj dribble style doesn't have the best push cross i will admit so that's something to kind of keep in mind with him that's not that bad of a shot i don't know how that's a nine percent somehow his whatever defender that was literally came from like across the court and got a contest there on that pop i thought cat was going to be wide open and he did not wind up being wide open so down four to two not the best start to the game catch and shoot up and pop that's peyton watson and that's Cash money, 8% green light. Love the release right there. Peyton Watson knocking it down. I shot it with confidence, knowing that he's got great shooting badges and all that ability. And we got a great result. Contest. Ooh, didn't get a contest. He hits the open. It's okay. We'll be fine. We'll be there in the next one. I believe it's going to, we're going to be just fine. He is a solid defender. And I know that's a couple of not elite defensive possessions, but we can 100% live with it. That was literally supposed to be a pump fake. And then I was going to wait to see between who of Oscar and uh, Peyton got open, but it will work out either way. And um, we'll take 
take it. Okay, we're out of position again. What is going on with me defensively right now? Good board. Let's go, Peyton. Beautiful stuff. Uh, I'm struggling defensively so far. It's me clicking out of position too. Attack downhill here. Wrong icon. That's okay though. We'll reset it up top and we'll go same side burst. Stop. Hit our pop and Peyton is there. I'd love to get off the screen here and get another. Yep. Beautiful. Got space. Got a jumper. It's a bucket. This card's a dog, man. Amethyst, 21K. I don't see why he can't play at a competitive level. I, I mean, he 100% can play at a competitive level. And, like, the player build is there, man. He's got the size. Good standing by Embiid. I was not in good. My defensive positioning has been bad all game. Whoever I've been clicked onto has just been out of position. I need to do a better job defensively. And I can't blame the game at all for my lack of stops so far. Um, so let's see what we can do here. Same side burst. Back between the legs. Attack the rim again. And hit our pop. Ooh, nice slip. Beautiful stuff. Good dunk. Good assist. Beautiful stuff by Peyton Watson creating the space and we're going to get back here x switch this and we got a good wall up on Embiid. let's go cat good d let's go throw it up the court to peyton watson between the legs reject the screen fade form oh it's not there i wanted to though and i'll take the inside finish oh that's really contested that much i thought that was gonna be a good layup i actually timed the release pretty well on the free throw there or the layup there i should say as well but it did not wind up working out that way good pass good shot i wasn't able to recover in time this dude's not a bad player he's done a good job executing making the right plays and he's kept himself in the game. Um, we're just going to run some freaking a uh, little backdoor cheese here. Come on, Peyton. Get draw a foul and one. No, he's tired. Dang. He's blinking and he misses the shot there. And I think he's about to be wide open. If he had stopped a little deeper, he might have been wide open for three. We're still in a fine defensive spot here. Can we get a stop? Peyton is a little tired. Going to need him to contest. He's... Oh, what a block. KP. Goodness gracious. I thought it wasn't going to be blocked. I thought that layup was going to go in. He has not been immaculate defensively. D-Book is admittedly very hard to guard, uh, but this has not been incredible defense. That's... I don't know how that doesn't get blocked. I'm going to be honest. I thought that was going to be a block. Instead, it's an and one, and he takes the lead. That's a little rattling. I'm not even going to lie, because I thought I was going to get a stop there, and he got an and one. I don't know if that's a lucky animation or just bad luck, or I don't even know what to call that, to be honest. We're running a floppy right here. I'm going to see if I can just get Peyton Watson to come off the screen here. I think... Oh, he's not... The Shoot, he was Paul George coming off the screen anyway. That was a bad play call. And I turned the ball over by running into a bump. Oh, no. We're choking the game. That's a steal. I played it. I played it. I played it, 2K. Let me play the ball. Good D. Board. Thank you. We got to stop. Two-point game. Peyton, come set me a pick and pop. He's not really a primary ball handler. Running my offense through Peyton Watson is probably not the smartest decision in the world. But, like, there's been worse decisions, right? Attack the rim. Hit our pop again. Back door. Peyton, Cut. He's going to jump, right? He's going to jump. He, he left. I knew it. We were gonna, he's going to make a mistake, and he did, and we got a three out of it. Let's go. Good assist. Peyton Watson is gassed. He is dying on the court. He's done his best, and he's doing a good job, but he is definitely gassed. If you could get through the screen here, that would be beautiful. That's D. He played great D just for me to, again, make a user defensive mistake and give up a bucket. If I lose the game, it's on my own. It's it's entirely my own fault. My defense has been beyond porous this game, to be completely honest. Great push pop up. Okay, back door here. Peyton, swing one more. Good pass. Oscar open. Three ball. Green. Let's go. Way to get the assists flowing there. He's crashed out of the corner a couple times, made a couple mistakes, and that has given us uh, a two-point lead here with 45 seconds left. Playing a little lower here. I'm not trying to give up a standing here. I'm just walling up. I'm not giving up a standing dunk. If he gets a standing through me, then he gets a standing through me. But in general, I just don't want to give up anything easy, and he still ran around me. Look at freaking Chris Stapps. Good Lord. Make a play then. He's still got a bucket out of it, unfortunately, but goodness gracious. Chris Stapps for Zingas wants to win, and I love to see it. Behind the back here, Peyton Watson run through his body hopefully okay well you okay well never mind uh, I might just have to go score with somebody else I'm not even gonna lie hit it out to KP come set me a screen Peyton same side burst I can't because he doesn't have the ball handle shoe yet he's dying on the court I'm running out of time uh we're gonna have to spin and shoot and Peyton Watson he got a contest tough we're gonna lose this game are we I had nothing I don't think running your offense through Peyton Watson was the smartest decision on that possession. I should have run something else. I didn't get through the screen. I rejected the screen. It didn't get me open. It just nothing was open. Good defense, I guess. Question, poor offense. And it's been a good gameplay, but I think we might come out of here with a loss, unfortunately. This is a card that can 100% compete at the competitive level. I would not recommend trying to run your offense through him, but he's very, very usable. I think at the two or the three, he's a great card. I think at the three, he's very solid. The two is his primary position, though. Hopefully, we can get a stop here. Hopefully, we don't get gamed. We'll see. I'm moving laterally. We get a block. Blocked it out of bounds. 
Well, if we can get another stop, we can go to overtime, and we might get one more opportunity on the offensive end of the court. Let's see what we can do here. Don't get backdoored here. Don't get backdoored. Don't give it up. Don't give it up. Contest, contest, good D. Good D. All right, overtime it is. Great defense by Peyton Watson. Maneuvered that quite well and got a great contest. And if we can win the tip here, we'll have one more offensive opportunity to win the game um, for sure. Great defense on that possession, though. Good job of not getting scored on there and losing the game. The way I played defense most of that game, I kind of was expecting to lose. But if we can win the tip here, we'll be just fine, honestly, because we're just going to go score real quickly. If we win the tip here uh and we do win the tip peyton watson go back door i do not care i do not care i do not care okay well they, they he doesn't want to go back door apparently cut i want to cheese my way to victory give me a standing i won <laughs> i won it did it let's go nine points one rebound four assists four six and one one for three peyton watson's a dog i had to cheese at the end of that to win but i'll take the win that was garbage i know but this card's really good best budget shooting guard in the game for sure super versatile good card not a primary ball handler but still a great option hope y'all did enjoy the video if you did make sure you hit that like button leave a comment and subscribe i'll be back on more 2k content very very soon i appreciate y'all peace